Hi Libra, welcome to a new reading. Messages for you right now, important messages of course. Whenever you see this, it is your reading. There is something here that you need to hear. And we're going to start with your oracle card, tarot cards. I don't know why I say oracle. Look at your cards, how they are flipping. And you know what? We are going to take them as they come. Okay, we're gonna take more cards, but for the moment, let's start with this. So we have a Six of Cups and Five of Cups here. Well, too much focus on, on things that happened to you, things that you lost, things people... It is draining you, and it is... Something that makes you maybe, you know, lose great opportunities in life. Good opportunities. So, clear message here to, to get yourself up again. Take a moment and rest. You need to heal your heart. You need to recover after a difficult time where maybe you you lost someone or something very important was for you and it's it's time to heal that it's time to to deal with the situation um the high priestess here shows how important it is to realign yourself again because right now you are like in pieces some of you right the tower here shows that um first of all is telling you that everything indeed happens for a reason. So for some reason you lost someone or for some reason a situation just did not went the thought the, the the way you thought it will. And you must stop now overthinking that. You are wasting such a great time and energy on things that are not in your power um, to control or change especially when we talk about past it is past it is done it is over so sitting there and you know overthinking the situation is not going to change anything so that is why the high priestess here i feel like it's just time to to get yourself out of this um dark times right and accept the change now the tower is an energy that you need to accept because it's coming up for a reason um maybe because sometimes when you you know hold on with your teeth on someone or something but you lose it anyway that is a clear message that was just not meant was meant in your life until some point and look at all these butterflies there is a change, a necessary change. So no matter how much you love that person or you love that job or whatever you lost, well, that doesn't count because they had a certain, um, you know, period to be in your life. Your next car here is the Eight of Cups. You see, you must leave behind you this energy. You must walk away from it. It's, it's just... It's just crazy to sit there where you are at right now. You must find your own path. You must become more independent. Um, Man of Pentacles here shows that, um, you know, this is your next, uh, let's say, stage or focus should be on your career or your finances or Pentacles can be something to do with your like your well-being, you know, to be well in all the ways. But you cannot be if you don't let go. You cannot be good if you don't have, you know, have the courage to to move away from this. The chariot here shows that when you disconnect from this, when you finally step out of this chapter of your life nothing will be stay in your way you will be good you will see 
how many good things will happen to you. Now with the King of Pentacles, again, a card of self-confidence and stability, it's a, a total shift here in your life. And I get the feeling that you kind of know that. It's just, of course, is not easy to... It's easy to say, yeah, stop thinking of this, stop talking about that, uh, move, move on from this situation. I know it's easy to say, but hard to do. But you are here to hear that you must start pushing yourself to focus on something else. Stop trying to repair things that cannot be repaired. So this is what I get for you here. As a, um, the most important thing is to take care of yourself and stop finding, stop trying to find reasons and excuses why certain things happened the way they did with what is going to help you if you know that. With nothing. If somebody is telling you this person left you because of this and that, is it going to change the present situation? No. You're still gonna be feel you. You're still going to to feel bad. You're still going to feel empty and betrayed and all those bads. So stop um, holding on into this and better focus on present and future. And in the present moment, you are being um, advised here. Your guidance is telling you to just turn your back and leave. Because nothing good can come out of this. Focus on your career. Focus on your job. Focus on your money. On your wealth. On your health. And have this confidence. Self-esteem that you've got this. With the chariot, you've got this. No matter what's in front of you, you will overcome. And you will get there where you deserve to be. In a much stable place. More secure you will be proud in the future for because of the, the changes that you are about to make. With these choices that you are making, you're going to be so proud of yourself. Now we have also here this future higher self uh, deck. It's an oracle deck and it is a great one with great messages. So let's see, Libra, what is what your future self wants you to know today. So you have spread your wings, confidence that leads to freedom and growth. That's amazing, right? Because it's exactly with the Eight of Cups and with the Nine of Pentacles. Confidence. You need confidence to spread your wings and fly and go there, go in, discover new, um, connect with new people. Try new things. Just don't, don't, don't stay where you are at. Especially where you are at with your mind right now. We also have this one. Denial. Failure to accept the situation. Unhealthy cycles or addictions. Do you see this? So you might say, I'm good. I'm fine. I'm doing great. But in the same time, when you are alone, where your mind is going, what you are thinking of, that's, that's something interesting, right? So don't deny. Be aware, as I said, that it was meant until a certain point. Now what you're going to do next? Let's see what else you got here. And you got divine timing. You see everything has a higher purpose there is no such thing as coincidence i don't believe that i believe that everything happens for a reason and there is a higher purpose for everything and there is this divine timing that nobody knows i don't know you don't know but it will happen to you look at look at this with the chariot and with the uh, king of pentacles well if you put the work right now in, um, you know, in your 
in what you have in your hands in the present moment, right? If you focus on your present moment, you see that uh, all this action will help you to to achieve goals, to build a better life for yourself, of course. You are going to be just fine if you can take your mind off the things that or people or situations that are not in your life anymore. My dear soul, this is what I've got for you in this moment. Thank you so much for being here with me. I wish you all the best. Don't forget to like, to share, to subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you very soon with a new reading. Bye.